Checkpoint's still open. Only got a few hours left until curfew. Well, we better hurry up then. Wait, are you serious? I gotta serve the damn papers this morning. I've been selected for outside work duty. Oh, that's such crap. Soldiers are supposed to handle the outside. I'll make sure to tell them what's happening. Attention. Citizens are required to carry a current ID at all times. Compliance with all city personnel is mandatory. Look at that. Ration line hasn't opened yet. It must be running low again. care anymore. Let him take me. Just be quiet. I'm not infected. Hold it's wrong. Down. This can's wrong. Do it. Please. Eyes forward. Hi. Seize down. Stop. Stop. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Shut up. Consider yourself lucky. It happens when you hide out in a condemned building. Call the cleanup crew. We're through here. Gonna need two bags and two more for the box. All right, people, this isn't a show. Keep moving along. Yes, sir. We'll stay put. They're on their way. Shouldn't be long. Seems like more people are getting infected. That just means more people are sneaking out. I got us all new papers. They shouldn't give us any static up there. Just play cool. You see your ID? There you go. What's your business here? Got the day off. Visiting a friend. All right. Move on through. Thanks. Get out of here, go! for the easy route. Patch yourself up, all right? <sighs> They're gonna close all the checkpoints. We're gonna have to go around the outside. Outside the wall? Or we could just let Robert go. <sighs> Cute. 
Hey, Tess, you see that shit? I was there. Hey, how's the East Tunnel looking? Uh, it's clear. I just used it. No patrols. And where are you off to? Gonna pay Robert a visit. <laughs> you too? Who else is looking for him? Uh, Marlene. She's been asking around, trying to find him. Marlene? What do the Fireflies need with Robert? <laughs> you think she'd tell me? Well, what did you tell her? The truth. I got no idea where he's hiding. Good man. Hey, you stay out of trouble, all right? Military's gonna be out in force soon. Yeah, see you around. Marlene looking for Robert? What do you make of that? I don't like it. You better find him before the fireflies do. This is us. Hey, guys. How's it going? <sighs> Shit's stirring up out there. How are we looking over here? Uh, it's been quiet. No signs of military or infected. That's what I like to hear. Joel, give me a hand with this. Yeah, I'll take it easy out there. Let there be light. Oh, God, this place reeks. We're way down here. Let's grab our gear. Our backpacks are still here from last time. Shots count. All right, Texas. Boost me up. You ready? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> <sighs> Careful. When am I not? <laughs> that a trick question? Ain't been out here in a while. It's like we're on a date. Well, I am the romantic type. You got your ways. Where's the ladder? Well, it's got to be around here somewhere. Got it. Great, bring it over. <clears throat> Ladies first. <laughs> Lady, you must be thinking of someone else. <laughs> it's all relative. This way.
Down through here. You think Robert still got our guns? For his sake, he better. Look, once we get our merchandise back, it should be easy to unload. Well, speaking of merchandise, when's that next shipment due? Well, we're meeting Bill next month. More pills, lots of ammo, supposedly. Yeah, well, he always shows up with something. Should keep us busy for a while. Hold up. Spores. coming from the place was clear last time They're coming out of something stay alert There's our culprit. Body's not that old. Better keep your eyes and ears open. Yeah, I should be able to fit through here. Oh, shit! You okay? Yeah. Damn ceiling's falling apart. Be careful. This way. Easy. Jesus. Watch it, watch it. Help me. My mask broke. Don't, don't leave me to turn. Please. What do you want to do? Poor bastard. all of them. Let's hope so. Let's head back into the city.
That's the one thing I love about the outside. I fucking hate the smell of the city. Why don't you ask Bill to get you some of them air fresheners? Hey, they weren't expired. That'd be a good idea. <clears throat> After you. Cover the entrance. I got it. Damn it. The plank fell down. Be a dear, would you? <laughs> I'll get it. <clears throat> Here, pass it to me. It's a bit heavy. I think I can handle it. We're getting close. Make sure there ain't any soldiers around. It's clear. Come on. Shut it. Pick up that ammo. I'm sure we'll need it. Hey, little man. Make sure the coast is clear. No soldiers, none of Robert's men, yeah? know he's expecting us. Well, that'll make it more interesting. <laughs> Good to go. Come on. Hey, Tess, hey, Tess. Hey, pretty lady, how you doing today? I heard you Not right now, night. Terrence. No, 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 it's, it's good. Look, Not I got the car. now. You hear me? Okay. You can do that. Okay, I'll help you pack it. Yep, we're starving. Keep your shirt on. Next batch coming right up. Hey, don't even think about cutting in line. Fucking A. Been waiting on this rack forever. Tess, it's been a while. You don't visit us anymore. Who the hell is that? None of your damn business.
Where do you think you're going? Malik, sit back down. Oh, sorry, Tess. Didn't realize you two were together. Go ahead. Who's that? An old headache. Don't ask. sorts of shit in the factory. Whoa, whoa, hold on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm looking for Robert. He come through here? Half hour ago. He went back to the wharf. He's there now. us through you guys need to turn around and head back if you know what's good for you our beef isn't with you we just want robert you don't want to do this turn the fuck around and leave now i'm not going anywhere without robert bitch i will bash your skull unless you turn around and get your dumb ass out of here fuck this take cover you ready yeah i'm gonna fucking kill you I'll cover you get the angle on them Cover me! Got it! Nicely done, Texas. <laughs> you too. How the hell did he get all these guys? If Robert's good at one thing, it's writing blank checks. <clears throat> Shit, not going through here. Hey, boost me up. All right, well.
Over here, Joel. More of Robert's guys. Shit, I see him. How do you know they're coming? Two of our guys died trying to take Tess out. I guarantee that she and Joel are on their way here right now to get Robert. Jesus. We shouldn't have taken this job. Not our call. He's in quiet, Texas. Let's spread out and make sure no one's creeping around in here. Move up. Move up. I meant to tell you, I was down on Jordan Street, and all these soldiers showed up with a group of about five civs, all in handcuffs. Let me guess. Fireflies? Yep. I lined them up against the wall, and bang, 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 they just executed all of them. <sighs> Shit. Yeah, I hear it's like that all over the city. They're cracking down on them hard. Yeah. I got a cousin with them. Seriously? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's search the area. Consolidated the crates in the south warehouse. Supplies are locked up. Good. Just do another once over and then head out. It's getting close to curfew. What about Robert? Who's he holing up with tonight? The guy's too paranoid to stay here by himself. Fuck if I know. We'll check in with the others and come up with something. Okay. Keep it up. Take it easy, man. Everything's cool. Should have brought more people. They just slow us down. Yeah, you're right. Come on, the docks are this way. Let's do this.
There's our boy. That cocky son of a bitch. Let's go wrap this up. Let's be smart about this. Shouldn't There's a lot of them. A long time. Yeah, well, we lost our contacts in the north. Lost our contacts in the south. Shit, I don't know who's left out there to sell us stuff. That better be good for us. Even if he is, then what? I'm telling you, he's known dumb for. We better take some action. Jerk. Going outside the wall of suicide. Well, plenty of the other smugglers do it. What do you think's gonna happen here once supplies run out? I'd still take my chances in here. Oh, Jesus. That office. Robert must have run in there. Let's go get him. Let's not wait around. Oh shit! Get back! Get the fuck back! We just want to talk, Robert. We got fucking nothing to talk about. Put your gun down. Go fuck yourself! He's running! Robert! Joel, this way!
first torture scene. <laughs> <laughs> and it's it's with the lovely Robin Atkin Downs, which oh, I was just joking and saying that it's not yeah. it's not a Naughty Dog game if Robin isn't getting the shit kicked out of him. <laughs> He's been in every game since uh, Uncharted One. Uh, and we <laughs> just put him through the ringer on this one. Poor guy. It, it was important to show just how far Joel has come, from the, the father you see in the, in the opening sequence to here is a man that is willing to torture someone to yep. just get but it's what so is essentially money in this world. Right, but it's interesting because he's not... He's, he's like that brutal enforcer. It's kind of like that scene in L.A. Confidential where he's, he's Russell Crowe. She's running the show. She's the, she's the dominating one, and I'm just she's, brought in to be the she's muscle. She's the brains of the operation. Yeah, <laughs> clearly. Stop, stop, stop! What you're squirming. That's all Robin's expressions too. It's so great. They did such a great job with the facial. Yeah, it's 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 important to note also all the facial is hand animated. We don't use any facial mocap. Um, we find that we get better results with our animators. And it almost becomes one to one. Yeah. It's just genius. Here it is. Wait for it. Give me a week. You know, I might have done that if you hadn't tried to fucking kill me. Mode of hesitation. <laughs> it's gonna cost you. We re-edited that. We used to show the break, and actually it was less brutal than when we didn't show it. When, when we didn't we, show it? Yeah, when it's left to your imagination, it's a lot worse. Yeah, but just you can see the way that his arm's positioned. But yeah, you're right. This, this is so revealing, not only about the relationship, but about, again, who Joel has become. To go from a father who just cares about you know, keeping his nose down and keeping the job and being playing by the rules, to, to being a guy who could just literally break some guy's arm over guns. It's just yeah. crazy. Come on. Fuck those fireflies. Just go get them. She loved doing that scene, too. And he loved that. She tried not to smile every time. And I love it's just business yeah. as usual. It's back to it. It's like, all right, so now what? And we're about to meet the very talented Merle Dendridge. Ah, uh, Merle. Now, here's something interesting about this. Again, going back to the audition, that process. We saw a bunch of different girls, even girls that we had originally seen for Tess, we brought back yeah. for to see. And they're all Marlene. really good. They're fantastic. Uh, and then then Merle came in and just and there I was no question. And I wasn't there for that. And and Ashley can chime in. Or Ashley, no. Ashley was part of the audition for for Merle. When she came in, it was it was hands down. Yeah. It's like that's Marlene. Come on. It's funny that all three of us knew like like right away that. Yeah, she needs to play Marlene. But you said we ended up setting up a special thing just for her. Yeah. Because you're like, you've got to see her. I want, I want you to yeah, see we, her. Yeah, we had callbacks, and she, she was busy. She couldn't make it. We had a special day of callbacks just to bring her, her in because we felt really confident that she could do it. So I felt like she was the only one who didn't play it all either super tough. Or street, yeah. Yeah, she kind of had Yeah, she really straddled that line. It was so great. But she, we did that first scene in the audition, literally first take, first scene, and her, she exits. It's at the very end of the game, and she turns around, she exits, and I turn around, look at Neil. I was like, I just mouth, are you kidding me? <laughs> yeah. It's like, and, and I, and I mouth, I told you so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she did such a great job. This is another kind of thing that I think is interesting that's happening in video games, where we see two really strong women characters, that female characters that aren't being over-sexualized. They're just strong women. We got to get out of here. Now. You want this deal? You got to move. You're here. I know a way around this. Come on. Is that your people? What's left of them? Why do you think I'm turning to you guys? <sighs> this way. So why now? We've been quiet. 
Been planning on leaving the city, but they need a scapegoat. They've been trying to rile us up. Looks like they did. We're trying to defend ourselves. <sighs> Joel, give me your hand. Enough. I'll live. Hold up, soldiers. That's the way out, the door under the bridge. I ain't a big fan of these odds. We can sneak by them, even though I know that's not your style. We'll see how it goes. Let's get moving. We need to get to that door. Good. Stay quiet. Okay. Watch yourselves. They're out in numbers today. Warren. No. Goodbye, friend. We should go, Marlene. There's bound to be more soldiers on the way. You're right. Let's move. further now.
Go on, inside. Where are we going, Merlene? This way. It's not far now. You okay? I'm running on fumes, but I'll make it. The place is right up ahead. Attention. Curfew is now in full effect. Shit, I need Anyone to hurry. caught outside without proper authorization will be arrested and prosecuted. Hell are we smuggling? I'll show you. Joel, give me a hand with this. Here we go. Ellie's introduction. Oh. Uh, and, and this stuff is all <laughs> shot out of sequence. So it's, 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 I don't know, maybe you guys can talk about the process of how you get into that state. I'm trying to remember that. I just really like the fact that the first time you see Ellie, you see her knife first. Right. I just yeah. think that's You see that she's awesome. a fighter. Yeah. I actually, I forgot that that was the first time that you saw Ellie. That that was the first scene. That just from the get-go, she's fighting. Yeah, but and it's it's not just it's she's fighting because she really cares for Marlene. That was that's kind of yeah. the, the crux of this is that you see these two characters really care for one another. And I, I love uh, in such a short time you see between Marlene and Ellie, there's this connection that's right. so important because that has to carry through to the end of the game when Marlene shows up again. Well, even like the, just the positioning of the two people. I mean, it's it's Joel versus Joel and Tess versus Ellie and Marlene. And just like. It's so interesting watching, right, Joel here has, like, doesn't even make eye contact with her. He doesn't even acknowledge her existence. Right. She's not crossing to that part of town. I want Joel to watch over her. Whoa, whoa, I don't Bullshit, think that's the I'm best Ellie. Him? Our first fight. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Bullshit! <laughs> I was close with his brother, Tommy. He said if I was ever in a jam, I could rely on him. Was that before or after he left? Just reminding the player, like the, this guy you saw in the beginning, Joel's brother, he's changed too and he's been involved. Yeah. Just get hints of. There's a falling out between the yeah. two of them. And it's just as you go on, you're starting to fill in that 20 year gap. Just cargo, Joel. Marlene. No more talk. Which is pretty true to your writing too, because I'm like, so what happened here? It's always, what do you think? What do you think happened there? Because <laughs> I have no idea. I don't have the time to write it. <laughs> <laughs> For Joel, right? That's that's a hint. It's like, I don't want to be around this kid. Right. Because right? uh, some subconscious part of him knows, I could get hurt here. Station. 